All right, welcome back. So we left off saving. We just finished the cave. Now we're going to continue our journey. I, I love how you can see the map up there. So we're going to go to this town. All right, what's the name of this town? Er. Okay. Hi, Luna. If the others went over to the co corner of town, I was wondering what I wonder what the hubbub's all about. I can't talk today. I'm sorry. Luna, the elders are looking for you. Uh oh, what did I do wrong? King Sassoon's castle is the west of here. He is lord of all the land surrounded by the Parmeni Mountains, including this village. I don't know what that little stutter was. All right, so let's see. What else we got? Heard that someone put a curse on the whole town of Casas. I'm not going anywhere near that place. Right, before I do anything, I want to make sure that I, I check some of these places um, and I don't trigger any events yet. So what do we got here? This looks like what I'm not. So I'm looking for the magic. So I uh, no, no. So the magic shop sells poison. Um, this is saying that all that does is it removes poison. We don't need. That's not worth buying at this moment. We do want to find the weapon shop though because they sell a bow, and we do want to buy the bow. Um, so there's the weapon shop. It's worth buying. Um, I don't know who we're gonna give it to. We'll figure that out as we move forward. You know. Okay, so. Uh, it says, go ahead and buy the bow, do not buy arrows. I'm going to trust they know what they're talking about. Alright, so we're going to go next door to the armor shop. Dang barrels. Alright, so, oh, stop it. So it says, buy a suit of leather. Okay, so I'm assuming leather armor. He worded that nicely, but that's not what it meant. All right. Um, and then the item shop sells potions, eye drops, and antidotes. Eye drops remove blind, antidote removes po poison, and potion gives you 50 health. You know, the big house near the entrance. The old guy in the middle of the room. I can sense what has happened to you. You must now heed the wards of Elder Topapa. Okay, so I think we go in here. You have come, Lunith, so it is you who has been chosen. You must understand that your meeting with the crystal was not happenstance. It was the crystal's will. You have been chosen. Chosen? For what? I don't understand. A long time ago, a traveler came to me, carrying a newborn child. His face was covered in soot, and his clothes were burnt to tatters. The child he carried in his arms was you. To think, even as a newborn, you are already destined to be chosen by the crystal. You must now set forth on your journey, take your powers, the light you hold in your heart, and use it well. All right. So... That's good information, I guess. Now he knows, and we were meant to be, and we're not. So this is another healing product. It's always good. Left fountain is healing. The right one revives. If you die, you can use a phoenix down. Wait. You can't buy phoenix downs in this, so that's a nice way to bring your people back if they die. Um... There's only 30 or so chests of Phoenix Downs in the entire game. So, I uh, hear you talk to the old man. Speaking of certain people can sometimes uh, open up the menu items so you can use items on them. Come try using a potion on me. Okay. Thank you, I feel much better. Take this as a token of my appreciation. Phoenix Down, alright. Alright. Walk east to the well. I don't know where the well is. Oops, I did something. My bad. Oh, yeah? Ghosts don't exist, then go there yourself and prove it. Huh, you don't have the guts. You're a coward. Ark! <laughs> Another orphan raised by Topapa. And Luna's best friend. Unlike Luna, he prefers reading over gamble, gambling in the wild. Gambling. I don't know what that means. Is that actually a thing or do they mess up? His studies endow him with great knowledge that more than makes up for his shyness. Hold on. 
I need to know if that's a thing or if they just, like, messed up the word. Gamboli. Holy crap. It might be... G run or present partic participle. Partic what? Run or jump about playfully. Okay, so that is actually a word. Look at that. I'm learning. Again, not changing any names. Hey, Ark, what's going on? It's Lou, let's get out of here. I'll beat you up. Well, alright. Hey, wait, Ark, you don't have to run away from me. Hey, I got purple eyes. I'm not a coward, but I know I have to be stronger. But I can't ask Luna out. I'll show them. That sounds like a disaster. Okay, this is not what I meant to do, so I think East is going to be left. Let's find out. We're looking for a web. That looks like an X. I didn't mean to do that. No, get out of there. Was that a Moogle? Not a Moogle, but a... Uh... Uh, 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 here we go. Oh! Well, okay. Potion? Potion, and how much you want to bet it's. Sir, get out. Hold on. Potion! Really, bro. I'm still not the greatest gamer in the world, but hey, we're all gonna have fun. I hope. Go past the weapon shop, so over here. There are bad guys here. Oh, didn't get any bad guys. Go inside the house. There are switches that open hidden passageways in towns and dungeons. You'll have to look closely to find them. Take a look at that candle, for example. If you zoom in close enough... It sparkles! See that shiny spot? Those sparkles tell you there's something fishy there. Oh, it's not literally fishy, so how do I zoom in? That was not the right button. Okay. Oh, that's how. Cool. Alright, we opened the secret passage. Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna go this way. Cool, cool, cool. Looks like we got a staircase. Oh, that's a lot. So what we got? We got a cure. And eye drops. Long sword, so that's three long swords now. A dagger. And a phoenix down. Alright. Okay. So good news is we're done with this little city for the moment. Um So I'm going to follow this guide's um, how to equip your people as well, because um, why not? I... Well, that was boring. It was a goblin. All right. It was just a, it was a simple, simple goblin. All right. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and leave town. Um, before we leave town, though, we're going to go park my butt right here, and we're going to go in here, and we're going to equip my character the way it's telling me to do it. So it's telling me that I want my right hand, I'm assuming this is my right hand, bronze knuckles, left hand, long sword, okay, now I hit hard, leather cap, leather armor, bronze vein, bronze bracers. There's one more thing. Okay. Do I go 
go up here to do it. We're gonna teach Luna. Sure. All right. Waiting for this below. Why is this not loading? My phone is frozen. Give me a second. No, I don't want. To, I don't care about crate and barrel, bro. All right. Okay. So we're gonna leave. Oh no, we gotta fight. All oh, right, that was two goblins, and they do about one damage a hit now, and I do between 24 and 27 so far. So yeah, we've definitely gotten better. So we're gonna keep going down here. We're looking for, I think this is it. This should be Kaz, Kazus, K-A-Z-U-S. Boom. Oh, Charlie, you stink. He farted. Oh, that's toxic. Alright. Ah! Ark, it's me, Luna. Don't be afraid. I scared him. <laughs> Why did you run off on your own? What are you trying to prove anyway? Let me go with you, Luna. I want to show everyone that I'm not a weakling. I did manage to come here all by myself. You'll take me with you, Luna, won't you? I guess. All right, if that's what you want. Charlie! Charlie! Hey! Hold on. Come here. What are you doing? You're interrupting my, you're interrupting my video, brother. My buddy, my buddy. Yeah, he's, he's fighting me. Ow, he's, ow, he's fighting me. Sick. Off, off, sit. All right. He didn't sit, so I'm ignoring him now. Mark has joined the party. Is the party? Off, off. Good boy. Sit, sit. All right, you're gonna get ignored. All right, that was fun. Okay, so it says... All right, found a mithril helm. Cool. All the shops here are closed due to ghosts and stuff. All right, so let's go ahead and equip Mr. Ark. He has a knife that is not going to cut it. Do I want to get another long sword? I'm going to give him that because I have a gut feeling he's probably going to be the weaker of the two of us. He has better defense now. Alright. Now, before you leave this area, there is... You want to go to the inn. Where is the inn? They're not selling anything because of blah blah blah. We're going to go in here. Now we're going to get something really cool. Okay, where is the innkeeper? Only the power of the mithril can banish the djinn. That is why the djinn cursed this town once it found out how the nearby mines were packed with stuff. Is there someone there, or am I tripping? I don't see him. Oh, there's... If only we had the mithril ring that the blacksmith had forged. It is the only thing that maybe banished the djinn. This is the one. Howdy there, Sid's the name. Sid! I'm from Canaan, but I've been stuck here ever since Nell Valley got blocked by a giant rock. You're saying a lot of words. Top of that, I got a curse cast on me along with these other folks. Ain't that a trip and a half? <laughs> uh, Luna, we have to do something to help these people. Say, if I lent you my airship, do you lads think you could help me in these others, perhaps? From what I hear, this curse can be dispelled throughout through the power of a mithril ring. Unfortunately, we all seem to be out of mithril rings here. Either we can get the mithril, Taka the smith has been turned into a ghost himself, and his daughter, 
The apprentice has gone missing. My airship's hidden in the desert west of here, use it to find a way to lift this curse. Okay, well, that's, that's unfortunate. Alright, so exit the town. We don't need to be here no more. There's a cave in the back. Don't do it yet. Exit the town. Go into the desert. We got an airship! Yay! Er, who, who are you? What are you doing here? I could ask you the same thing. This is Sid's airship, and he's letting us use it. Alright, her name is Refia. I don't know if that's correct, but that's what I'm going to call her. It'll probably change, don't worry. Uh, raised in Kazoos by the Mithra Smith Taka, whose rigorous training led her to run away from home again. There's always got to be a girl that runs away in I swear, it's like a thing. I'm Refia, and I'll have you know my, my father and I forged the parts of the ship back in Kansas. So that means you're the blacksmith's daughter. You have to help us make a mithril ring. Yes, that's the only way we'll be able to lift the curse on castles. I... I can't. I can't make mithril rings. I didn't study that far. I didn't want to... Well, I don't think Sid's going to be particularly happy with that news. Wait! I know where we can find a ring. My father forged the mithril ring for King Sassoon a long time ago. He should still have it. Let me go with you. I can't make mithril rings, but I want to help my father and the people of Kazakhstan. I think she should come with us, Lord. Me too. Slacking off saved her from the curse, so maybe that luck might rub off on us. Hey, that's not funny. Um, I'm also going to keep her with her normal name. Actually, they didn't even let me change her. Okay, now we're gonna equip her. You guys seeing a pattern yet? I'm seeing a pattern. Alright, she's got a knife. Hey, she can get a long arm. We'll give her the dagger. Oh. Gotta work for the moment. Alright, fully equipped. All aboard! This is the earliest in a Final Fantasy game that I'm aware of that you get an airship. I mean, they usually make you wait. Alright. However, they do tie you, you can't go past these mountains. They were smart. Alright, this is where we're going. And I think this is where I'm going to end the video. So until... Uh, these are going to be short videos until I get used to this and I get time. Um, so until next time, which will be about nine minutes from now, adios amigos.